Hi Cancer, this is Sandy Couture and I am here doing the astrological tarot reading for the sign of Cancer for the month of August 2023. It's actually Leo season. We've just left Cancer. The sun has just left Cancer and um, Venus left Cancer and they're both in Leo. Uh, however, Venus is going to go retrograde and with that, what we any retrograded planets ask us to review, rewrite, or redo situations, uh, relationships, jobs, plans, whatever that is. And Venus rules money, love, what we deeply value, beauty in our life, and um, and balance. And it is being squared this month, or having pressure put on it from the planet uh, Saturn, because Saturn is about manifestation and crystallization, but in order to do that, Saturn is about structure. So Saturn is asking us to take a look at things, and Saturn is also retrograde, to review things and review the structure of the balances and the different things in our life, and then possibly redo them to serve us on a higher and better um, path. So the first card that I pulled for you, Cancer, is the King of Cups. Interesting because Cups is a water card and Cancer, of course, is a deep water sign. King of Cups actually represents a guardian angel. So it feels as though right now you're being watched over uh, closely from a guardian. Um, pay attention to the messages you're getting, numbers you keep seeing or signs you keep reading, whatever that is. Uh, the surprise or challenge card is it's asking you, Cancer, to tend to your garden. It's a seven of pentacles. Tend to your garden so that it can grow. And basically, when we're talking about tending to our garden, it's really not about a garden. It's about our internal life, our internal self, our internal thoughts and feelings, because those things Things create our tomorrow and every tomorrow after that. So tend to that. Don't just allow it to have no boundaries like water would do. So the process card for you this month, another watery card, interesting, is the moon. The moon is all about intuition and it's, I guess, maybe during this rewrite, redo, and review series, it's time for you to go dive deep into your intuition and, and dive deep into your internals to ask um, what you should know that isn't bubbling to the surface yet and allow it to come forth. And <clears throat> the most likely outcome card is another king, the king of wands. Now wands are action or fire card, but this is all about, um, I looked it up because um, court cards can represent people or situations. Like in a private reading, this could represent an older gentleman who either wants to help you, mentor you, or have a relationship with you. But in a general reading, it's a, it says, being the master of creative imagination and also being clear about who you are and the ability to express yourself. So all of these deep internal things that you're doing are leading you to a place where you will have a greater understanding of you and be able to express it to others in a clear and conscionable way. So that's a nice reading for you, Cancer. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you have a wonderful month. Thank you so much for watching. Bye now.